it's actually New York City and Nassau. Uh, their council's interpretation of the election law uh, is that they, they are not allowed to do what you suggest that, and the other counties do, which is take the flash drive. Uh, the first thing to understand, these are the unofficial results. Uh, the official results are actually gotten by taking the flash drives and getting them off the machines. Uh, but uh, like I said, that's an interpretation by the New York City and Nassau Boards of Elections. Other people disagree with it. I know at least one of the commissioners of the State Board of Elections think the city and Nassau are wrong, that they can take the flash drive. Uh, I think the dispute has to do with the election law says what New York City and Nassau have to do, uh, which is do a manual count by however they way to do it. Before we had these electronic machines, we had lever machines and they didn't print out anything. They they just li literally read it off the machine. When, once the machine was opened under each candidate's name, the number of votes they got was on there. Uh, but that can't be done anymore. Uh, the people who think the board of election, the city board of elections, legal authority is wrong is that they're misunderstanding what you have to do and what you can do. I mean, some people think, yeah, you have to do this, do that whole handwritten thing, but you could also take the flash drive and go to the, bring it to the Board of Elections and get a quick, more likely to be accurate number. It is true, they, they are correct that the, the state election law does specifically say how New York City and Nassau can count their votes on primary night and election night, and they don't say that for the other counties, which I was pretty surprised to hear, but then I checked and it's true. Uh, but like I say, there is a, the other argument is Yes, you have to do this, but you could also do other things to get a more accurate, unofficial count. And that's the thing I think that people haven't stressed enough, that these numbers are unofficial. And, you know, in New York State, because we're voting with paper that go through a computer, there is a paper trail. And it's not like these numbers are on a machine and if somebody hacks the machine, they could steal the election because the other campaign can always demand to look at the paper.